Hi guys, this is Lubel Tran for another video for Make It Easy. And today, one of my assignments dito sa work ko is to install a 4507 Cisco switch in one of our brand new data racks. Now, itong data rack na to is uh, a little bit special. It's a brand new product from Eaton. It has its very own UPS pa uh, power supply and its own air conditioning system. Medyo unique siya kasi um, ang traditional cabinets sa isang data center, uh, bare metal lang siya. It's really there to house and manage the cabling system of your equipment. But for this network rack, um, it has its built-in uh, air conditioning system, monitoring system, and a UPS to power all of the devices just in case magkaroon ng power outage. And as you can see, natapos na ng contractor namin ang um, structured cabling and the patch panels of this network uh, cabinet. Now, it's up for me as a network engineer to install the Cisco switch and um, connect it to our network. So, let's get started. So, for the contractor to properly finish his work, kailangan ko tapusin yung pag-install ng ating Cisco switch because they cannot terminate the patch cords from the patch panels itself going to the switch kung wala pa yung uh, switch natin itself. So, let's get started. So, ang una kong ikakabit muna is um, the two power supplies here kasi yung pinakamabigat na uh, parts ng ating Cisco switch. But basically, this 4507 is still uh, in chassis mode. Ibig sabihin, it's bare metal. Wala pa siyang masyadong lamang uh, modules for it. So, let's get started. So, kunin ko lang yung power supply at the uh, other room and blades for the Cisco switches, uh, for the Cisco switch. And let's get started. Okay, so here's the power supply. Medyo mabigat siya. Okay, so power supply one is already inside. So, I thought this is called modular switches for your uh, uh, for those uh, students that are watching right now. So, modular switches and Cisco is basically used for high end uh, applications. So, ito yung mga pinakamamahal na switches that Cisco provides for its enterprise clients. Ang kagandahan kasi ng modular switches is pwede mo i-customize yung blades ng inyong uh, or yung functionality ng inyong switch. So for this case, makikita ninyo, um, this Cisco switch has two power supplies um, for redundancy. Kailangan ng dalawang power supplies. Just in case bumigay ang isang power supply, the other one can take over and power all of the system until we can get a replacement for the broken one. It's now time to install the modular blades. So, ito yung switch blades for our 4507 chassis. So, ang kagandahan kasi ng modular switches, um, it's upgradable and interchangeable yung uh, mga blades niya. So, if for this case, itong kinakabit kong blade is for copper switch. It's a copper type switch. Now, kung kailangan nyo naman ng fiber optic switches, what you need to do is just, but you just buy uh, a fiber optic switch blade, then you can just insert it here that will function as a regular uh, switch pa rin. So, ang kagandahan ng modular switches in its simplest form or in, in its simplest definition is it's interchangeable and upgradable. So, nakatatlo na akong blades. It's now time for the supervisor modules. Okay. 
na the supervisor modules ang gamit nito is this is where the brains of your modular switch is located dito rin nakalagay ang inyong Cisco IOS Now I'm installing one of the supervisor modules okay and I'm going to get the second one kasi alam niyo naman sa IT two is better than one so meron tayong primary and secondary dapat lagi kang may redundancy in terms of your equipment So that's it for our Cisco switch in, uh, installation. Now, yung contractors natin is umuwi na kasi it's very late in the night already. Um, medyo uh, kailangan din nila matulog kasi galing din sila ng Manila. And kanina na sa biyahe. Then they went straight here to do off the structured cabling connecting this cabinet to our workstations. Now, ang kulang na lang nila. They were waiting for me to install the Cisco switch. And from there, aayusin nila yung cords to be connected to our Cisco switch. So that's it fellow IT engineers for this uh, segment ng Make It Easy. Uh, I've just finished tracking up yung Cisco switch natin and I'll see you next time.